What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. 2021 Panini Flawless Baseball just sold out. This is a one-box briefcase break. Random teams number six. 30 total spots. Everybody gets a random team in the MLB. Here we go, guys. Dice roller. Customer names. From Dusty down to Steve Bodden straight up. Danny down to Danny. Wando's in a pack filler. And D-backs down to the Washington Nationals. <clears throat> Roll. Two and a four. Six times. Good luck. One. Two. Three, four, five, six. Two and four, six. Michael, down to Michael. Six times. One, two, three, four, five, six. Dodgers out of the Royals. All right, so six times, six times. Here we go. Michael, you have the Dodgers. Dusty with the Yankees, Rockies, Cardinals, and Tigers and A's. Michael with the Blue Jays. There you go, Michael. Nicholas with the Angels. Damn, look at that. Brother's doing well. Twins, Dusty with the Cubs. Pirates. Orioles, Danny, you have the Guardians, Dusty with the White Sox, Steve with the Braves, very nice, Dusty with the Rangers, Danny with the Reds, Michael with the Tampa Bay Rays, Steve with the Astros, Dusty with the Brewers, D-backs, Michael with the Giants, Dusty with the Marlins, Steve with the Nationals, Dusty with the Mariners, Nicholas with the Phillies, Dusty with the Red Sox, Steve with the Padres, Dusty with the Mets, and Michael with the Kansas City Royals. I'll pause the video for trades, if we don't have any trades we'll come back and we'll uh, break open flawless. All right, welcome back, guys. No trades, no trades. Sticking to what they got. I know it's early. Not a lot of people watching right now, but hey. You got a break sold out. And we about to do it. Flawless RT6. This feels heavier than normal, but I could just be tripping. Oh, there's a middle card. Wow, there we go. There's a middle card, guys. Nice. We got a middle card. I guess judging by the first briefcase, that was probably going to happen, right? Actually, I don't really need this there. It's a little high. All right, here we go, guys. Good luck. First one is a jumbo patch of Cespedes for the Chicago White Sox. I heard someone say last week he had like two home runs. Something crazy. 17 out of 25. That's Dusty. A one out of five, Ramon Lariano. Look at that. A little majestic tag right there. Three color patch at the top. One out of five. That's definitely a 180. Oakland. Actually, you gotta get the sheet. Dusty with Oakland. Das Cameron. 
Two color patch and autograph to 25 for Detroit. Detroit. Dusty. Another majestic tag. Two out of five. Brandon Rogers. That is for the Colorado Rockies. Another one for Dusty. to back for the Colorado Rockies. One out of five honored ink gold. Andres Galarraga. Damn. Have yourself a break, Dusty. Xander Bogarts for Boston. Eight out of ten. Boston, that's also Dusty. Jesus. And last one here is a dual rookie patch autographs. Casey Mize and Nate Pearson. That's two color patches and autographs. 18 out of 20. That's Detroit, which is Dusty. Toronto, which is Michael. So that'll be the randomizer right there. some nice cards though I must say very nice low numbered cards good luck there is three hits in here though so there's still the big stuff um, I want to say that this should be the relic or this should be the diamond I want to say or maybe not maybe no that looks like a patch I don't know I'm nervous maybe this is the diamond oh this is the diamond okay George Bradford, Kansas City. 15 out of 20. Kansas City going to Michael. Okay, so this is going to be your patch autograph. Christian Pache for Atlanta. 4 out of 25. Nice rookie RPA. And he was just traded. I think to Oakland, right? Good, good prospect right there. But that's still going to go to Atlanta here. Steve Birch, last spot mojo. There you go, buddy. Very nice RPA. And here comes... Looks like a cleat. It's a one-of-one one cleat. Oh my god, it's actually not a cleat. Wow, it's Bill Terry. That's a uh, bat barrel. Wow. Bat barrel, one of one. Bill Terry for New York. And I want to say that is New York Giants. I don't want to actually flip this card. I feel like it's going to get damaged in this. But then again, it's slabbed and I don't want to mess with it. Wow, okay, hold on. Let me, let me double check it really quick. I I just don't know why they don't just actually just put them in a normal slider box or something. Yep, this is card number one, bat barrel set, Bill Terry, New York Giants, New York Giants. So that'll be going to the Giants and Michael. Well, look at that. And just in case, of course, you know, not many of us know who Bill Terry is. He is a uh, first baseman slash manager. Uh, I was in the 1920s as a player, 23 to 36, as a manager for the Yankees after. Actually, he was a manager for the Yankees while he was actually playing as a Yankee. Damn, that's crazy. Three-time All-Star, World Series champion, NL batting champion, and number three, retired for San Francisco. Ooh. 
And then he was inducted into the Baseball Hall of Fame in 1954 in his 14th ballot. So, I mean, regardless, this dude's a Hall of Famer. And is that a picture? Who was that with? Oh, that's pretty nice. Well, there you go. Very nice. Is that a sell sheet hit? I don't remember that being a sell sheet hit, is it? I guess it might be. Oh, yeah, it's right there, actually. That, that's exactly the card right there. There you go, man. Well, congrats, man. That is a Bill Terry Bat Barrel. I don't know, Michael, if you're super into leaving it as is sealed, but I, I'm just saying I, I'm afraid to like, the, what I'm saying is that like, if I move this and I, the shipping team might have to pack this, if it flips, it's gonna move. And I don't want the car to get damaged. If you're okay with it, I don't, if you don't mind me actually ripping it open and actually putting it into a reel, or actually if anything, putting more fillers onto this, so that way it doesn't move, because I don't want the car to get damaged, but I'm letting you know now it's going to get damaged like this. So, I mean, if you're cool with this thing sealed, let me know. I, we won't touch it like that and leave it as is, but I feel like it's probably better to unseal it, put some fillers in there so it doesn't move at all. Um, but it's up to you, man. I know sometimes people hate to open this because then it might damage the value of it, but the card's going to get damaged in here rattling, so uh, let me know. But appreciate it, guys. That was Flawless Baseball. Very nice RPA. Nice diamond and some very nice hits in here. We do have a randomizer to do, though, really quick before we end up. Here, Casey Mize, Nate Pearson. Um, yeah, I'm just saying is that I think it's best to keep the card in better condition than it is to keep it sealed. Um, and obviously, you have it on video, and I'll do it on video so people can see it. But, um, yeah, if not, the card's going to move as it flips, and I wouldn't want the card to get more damaged if it already is or, you know, try to preserve it. But, like I said, I'll leave that up to you and you let me know, man. I'm just saying for, for preserving the card so it doesn't get as damaged. For the cleat, we don't do it because the cleat kind of stops the card from moving. But with this, it's a little different. There's no cleat to stop the, the card from moving out or the spike, you know? So, so we got Blue Jays. And then... Um, Tigers. Let's get the dice roll there. All right, Blue Jays, Tigers. Roll it. Uh, four and a five, nine times. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Boom, stays with the Tigers, four to five, nine times. So there you go, Tigers, uh, I believe that is Dusty. There you go, man. I think you pretty much wiped out the whole loose box, loose cards in there. Appreciate it, guys. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Look out for the next one.